Hello, I'm Sean Hansen with the Orbis Company. I'm the fishing manager at Orbis Chicago. Uh, today I'll be tying you my, uh, it's called the Hansen Harasser. It's a nice single hook streamer. It's about three inches long. I've got a finished one for you there. That'd be that guy. Nice rides inverted. Stays pretty snag free. It's a great all around streamer for everywhere you go. All right, start off. I always pre glue, pre tie on my glue in my eyes so they're ready to go for when I start tying my flies. Red start here. First off, I tie in a about 20 strands of Airlines Baitfish Emulator. Next, I take three clumps of Senyo Laser Dub in white for the olive version of this fly. On the, uh, I'll tie this in another color using natural colored rabbit strip. For that, I use the silver minnow belly Laser Dub. Tying in the laser dub is kind of the most common practice I've seen so far. Kind of print out the dubbing into little hunks like you would with any other yarn or ram's wool or even deer here. Tie it in the halfway point and just fold it back. That really locks it in place. Next up is I attach the rabbit strip. Now I pre measure my rabbit strips and cut about two inches of hide off. And that gets them ready to go for me for this fly. I'm gonna measure it up, make sure the end of the hide is gonna be right below the eye there. Grab it, and I'm gonna pierce the hide with the hook. Now, I'm going to take a clump of olive laser dub and tie that in the exact same way. One more. All right. Now, on each side, goes a rubber leg. What I do is I take a single strand from a clump like this. Cut it in half, that gives me each side. Tie that in at the halfway point. Give it a quick fold over. This side so you guys can see it. Halfway, fold it over. I have a red dyed grizzly saddle hackle, nice large fibered. I like the webbier ones, I feel that they flow a little bit more. Take about one side, about five, six wraps, give or take. Take the ankle fibers on what's going to be the top side, the olive side. Stick those in right there. And 
Now a little trick I found to help cover up the dumbbell eyes using the laser dub is I'll actually tie it right on top of the dumbbell eye. Three, four wraps is all you need so you can see it's right on top of there. That's just going to fold itself back. Alright, now I add another color. Let's just sculpt an olive laser dub. A little bit of texture and modeling to the color of the, the sculpin that this is supposed to represent. Over. One last clump of white. One last good large clump of olive. work in there so they're all the way around the hook shank hiding that little bit of thread in front of the eye. that and to make this guy absolutely bomb proof a little bit of clear cure goo hydro on the thread all right so that wraps up the harasser I said I tied in Two different colors as of right now. You've got the natural kind of barred rabbit, and then you got your good old olive. I also tie these guys using some uh, sculpin helmets. Basically, to tie these guys, just don't put the lead eyes on there and build up the laser dubs. A little bit extra, one or two extra clumps in there on each one, and then you just slide these guys over with some super glue, and you're good to go there. It's great all around streamer pattern. This guy's caught fish all over the world already for me, so I've got friends and, and travel. So, great fly, give it a shot. Thank you.